Hello audience, my name is Lucy wish you happiness and prosperity. Editor Lucy would like to welcome you for visiting and here is the official news. One, is Hoda Kotb leaving today? Where she's going after the show Hoda Kotb announced her departure from the Today Show after nearly 20 years as co-anchor. Expressing her mixed emotions in a heartfelt letter to her colleagues, she emphasized that while she is leaving the show, she will still be around and cherishes the relationships built during her time at NBC. Hoda described her decision as painful yet necessary. Reflecting on her long career and the support she received from her co-workers. 2. Shailene Woodley Health All about her mysterious medical issue Shailene Woodley has raised concerns about her health after discussing a past health scare during an interview on the SheMD podcast. The 32-year-old actress who starred in the 2014 film Divergent, revealed that she experienced troubling symptoms, including hearing loss and severe fatigue, which made it difficult for her to walk or eat without discomfort. While she shared some details about her health struggles, she chose not to disclose specific information, emphasizing the personal nature of her experiences. 3. Why was Eric Adams indicted? The NYC mayor's charges Mayor Eric Adams was indicted on September 26, facing multiple charges including conspiracy to commit wire fraud, federal program bribery, and receiving campaign contributions from foreign nationals. In a recorded statement, he maintained his innocence, claiming he is a target of false accusations from the federal government. This marks a historic moment as Adams is the first sitting mayor of New York City to be indicted while in office. Prompting widespread curiosity about the reasons behind the indictment both locally and nationally. 4. Eric Adams Charges The NYC mayor's fraud and bribery allegations New York City Mayor Eric Adams is facing legal issues after being indicted on five charges, which were revealed on September 26. He stated in a video that he believes the federal government intends to charge him with crimes that he claims are false and based on lies. Despite the indictment, Adams remains committed to serving the 8.3 million residents of New York City. The specific charges include conspiracy to commit wire fraud, federal program bribery, receiving campaign contributions from foreign nationals, wire fraud, and solicitation of a contribution. 5. Where are the Menendez brothers now? Inside the Richard J. Donovan Correctional Facility Lyle and Eric Menendez have been imprisoned since 1996 for the murder of their parents, Jose and Kitty Menendez. Their story has gained renewed attention due to the release of Ryan Murphy's series, Monsters, The Lyle and Eric Menendez Story. After their conviction, the brothers were initially separated and placed in different prisons. Lyle was held at Mule Creek State Prison, while Eric was at Folsom and Pleasant Valley Prisons. In 2018, they were both transferred to the Richard J. Donovan Correctional Facility in San Diego, where they were initially housed in separate units but later reunited in the same housing unit. 6. Do the Menendez brothers have kids? What happened after marriages Lyle and Eric Menendez were sentenced to life in prison for the 1989 murder of their parents? Now aged 56 and 53, they have built lives in prison, with Eric being a stepfather to his wife Tammy's daughter, Talia, while Lyle, who is also married, has no children. Eric and Tammy have been married since 1999.
having started their relationship through correspondence. The recent release of a series about their story has sparked renewed interest in their family lives. 7. Why is Hoda Kotb leaving today? Her reason revealed Hoda Kotb announced her departure from the Today Show on September 26 after 17 years with the program. In a heartfelt letter to her colleagues, she expressed mixed emotions about her decision, acknowledging the pain of leaving while affirming it was the right choice. Hoda reflected on her long career at NBC, which included a decade at Dateline, describing it as the longest professional love affair of her life. Fans are curious about her reasons for leaving. 8. Where is Hoda Kotb going after today? Hoda Kotb is leaving her role as co-anchor on the Today Show at the age of 60, after joining NBC in 2007. During her announcement on September 26, she expressed that it was time for her to embrace new opportunities, reflecting on her experiences and the joy of her current position. While her future plans remain unclear, there is curiosity about what she will pursue next. 9. Who is Alex Spiro? Meet the celebrity lawyer defending NYC Mayor Eric Adams New York City Mayor Eric Adams has hired prominent attorney Alex Spiro from Quinn Emanuel to represent him as he faces federal charges of bribery, fraud, and campaign finance violations. Spiro, 41, is known for being one of the more expensive lawyers and has a strong background in law. Having earned a psychology degree from Tufts University and a Juris Doctor from Harvard Law School, he previously worked as a prosecutor at the Manhattan District Attorney's Office, which has shaped his expertise in white-collar criminal defense and litigation. Spiro emphasizes his commitment to taking on challenging cases. 10. Molly Gordon Five things about Jeremy Allen White's The Bear, co-star Molly Gordon and her co-star Jeremy Allen White from Hulu's The Bear were recently seen together, sparking speculation among fans about a possible real-life romance. Molly, known for her multifaceted talent in the film industry, has been steadily building her career as an actress. In The Bear, she plays Claire, Carmi's girlfriend, who broke up with him at the end of season two, and they did not reconcile in season three. Hollywood Life has compiled various facts about her career and achievements.